Hello everyone, it's Ash from Whiskey Wars here and today we have a really different video because uh, I'm no longer living in England, I'm living in Ireland so that's why there's a different background. Um, I didn't actually manage to bring any whiskies with me to Ireland so I thought what better to do than to buy a load of Irish whiskies when in Ireland so today we have a whiskey that I would have never heard of at all before um, I'm actually living in Cork and this is a local distillery, uh, West Cork, and it's a blended Irish whiskey. It's cheap, it's affordable, and it's half the price of the Jameson Black Ball, um, Black Barrel, uh, I should say, which are two charred Irish whiskey barrels, uh, finished whiskies. Um, I believe the Black Cask is number five for its char level. I'm not sure what the black barrel is, but I do know that it's been double charred. So let's see what the difference is between the two. But um, I, was, I was rather nervous when I bought the Jameson black, ball, black barrel because it was 50 euros in, the, um, in Ireland, whereas I've seen it on offer in the UK for 25 pounds. At the minute, there's not a huge difference between the pound and the euro, so it was rather expensive. Um, luckily, the West Cork was half that at 25 euros, but I believe it can drop to 20 when on offer. So I thought it was a perfect um, opportunity to review this because um, essentially what we have here potentially is a Jameson Black Barrel competitor that's half the price. So let's see how they compare. If you can tell from the colour, there's not much in it, but the Jameson Black Bar Barrel is a darker shade of, I would say it's a copper amber colour. Both these whiskies are 40% ABV, by the way. On the nose, the Jameson has the stronger of the two noses. It's more concentrated and condensed in its um, flavour profile. But very similar, very similar indeed. It's, um, it's very bourbony um, in the sense that it, I don't know if you can hear that, but I'm living right next to an airbase at the minute, so. You might get a few interruptions in the videos. The West Cork Black Cask is quite bourbony on its nose. Fudges, brown sugar and caramel. Butterscotch. The Jameson is that too, but it's, um, it's a lot stronger on the nose. And you also get a really strong vanilla and sugar syrup, maple syrup, um, type of nose on there. Um, overall, the Jameson wins on the nose. It's it's a lot more concentrated and stronger, a lot more potent, but similar noses. Uh, the West Cork is just weaker. Quite woody, which I like. Very different to your ordinary Irish whiskies. The charred, the charred barrel takes it into a hybrid of a bourbon and an Irish. Um, it makes the whiskey far more sweeter, um, smoother, thicker. Um, But there's this dense sugar syrup in there. It's like drinking maple syrup at times, um, which I'm not sure I like, but I'd imagine a lot of other people would like.
as the nose was stronger on the Jameson, the taste is too. That being said, a stronger taste is not always a better thing. Um, especially when I said it's like drinking maple syrup at times. The Jameson is thicker and more sugary. So it's like drinking more maple syrup in a drink than the West Cork maybe has half the maple syrup in. That being said, the Jameson it has more flavour on the taste. Um, there's a big citrus kick to it. It's quite lemony and orangey, which the West Cork doesn't have, but the West Cork has a really nice wood note to it that the Jameson doesn't have as well. It's more watery, a little bit nutty, but a lot more woody as well, which actually makes it more drinkable, uh, as in I could happily drink more of the West Cork than I could the Jameson because the Jameson's a little bit too sickly and sweet for me. Um, that being said, the Jameson out of the two is the better whiskey. I think if you were to mix either of them, they'd be really good as mixers. Um, because for me, if I'm mixing a whiskey, making a cocktail, I usually go for a bourbon and not an Irish, not a scotch, but I'd be really interested in trying these two because like I say, it's like a halfway house between a bourbon and an Irish. You have the creaminess of the Irish with the brown sugar, maple syrup, fudge sweetness of a bourbon. Maybe, what would you say was more interesting? The Jameson adds a citrus hit to it um, which is really vibrant and fresh but it's more sickly at the same time whereas the West Cork adding that wood element and the nuts element to it um, I, I'll probably lean towards the Jameson it, it certainly tastes um, higher quality and I can tell why it's worth more money but double the money 50 euros for me it's really steep as a price for the Jameson. Really steep. It's the better of the two whiskies, and I think most people would agree with that if you had them side by side. That being said, if you didn't have them side by side and you enjoyed charred uh, barrel Irish whiskies, which in my opinion, uh, reduces the orchard fruit, the apples and the pears, and replaces that with brown sugar caramel, maple syrup. Um, I think everyone should try a charred barrel finished Irish whiskey, if I'm being honest. Super interesting, really different to what you'd, you would expect. Um, me going into it, I see black cask and I see black barrel and charred barrel. And I'm, I went in thinking maybe there's going to be a smoky element to the whiskies. There's not. It does the opposite. It doesn't add, doesn't turn up a wood note or a nut note or a smoke note. Instead, it makes it lighter, sugary. Um, completely different direction to what you would expect. Um, having said that, Price-wise, 25 euros um, or 50 euros. Uh, I've seen the Black Barrel in the UK on offer for 25 pounds. And I think if you ever see that deal, jump on it. It's worth it, 100%. Really recommend it. Do I recommend it at 50 euros? No way. Um, I really don't. I think it's too, too much money. When you can get a half-priced one here. Is it as good as the Black Barrel? Maybe not. I don't think it is. The nose is a lot weaker and the taste is a lot more subdued. But I actually enjoyed the wood element to it and a little bit of a nut element to the whiskey. Um, it tastes a little bit sharper. The 
black barrel is extremely smooth um, but it's, it's like drinking maple syrup at times and for me that's that's not a whiskey I, I particularly am drawn to um, and I don't think I'd buy it again however if I saw it for £25 I'd be tempted and I, I would recommend anyone to get it for £25 but if we're talking normal price for both whiskies at a hundred percent if you can get the West Cork um, black cask I'd really recommend trying it out um, I've not seen it in the UK obviously living in Cork it's it's available everywhere uh, in Tesco the popular supermarket it's, it's everywhere there too um, in fact it's in a lot of different supermarkets that I've seen uh, wi widely available in Ireland I'm not sure outside of Ireland so you'd have to check on that but if you do if you if you can buy the West Cork I, I would certainly recommend it and I would actually say today the winners the West Cork if anyone watching enjoys the video or found it helpful in any way uh, please consider dropping a like on the video and subscribing to the channel it really helps me out and I also have Instagram and TikTok which I'm starting to get into a little bit to post some other type of content on there which is obviously a lot shorter uh, TikTok being a few seconds Instagram mainly being just pictures but sometimes short videos going through a whiskey on its own in brief detail just giving you a heads up on what sort of direction that whiskey is taking you in if you're interested uh, my Instagram is whiskey wars UK uh, with no e in there and my TikTok is just whiskey wars like the YouTube channel so thanks for watching guys